The Cannonball Run is a legendary coast-to-coast -coast endurance race, normally done by car. But when Justin Barnes found out there was a similar event for scooters, he couldn't wait to put the throttle down. Like I'm doing it on my own regardless. Whether I go into debt for 10 years or I have to quit my job, I'm riding across the country. Justin, a member of Seattle-based Soldiers of Destiny Scooter Club, convinced seven other members to join him on a 3,700-mile odyssey from Florida to Washington at the less than blazing speed of around 45 miles an hour. Riding lawnmowers have larger motors than what these things do. The crew spent months preparing for the trip, but what they couldn't prepare for was Mother Nature. The country gave us everything it had when it came to weather. Every change in weather you're feeling on your skin versus just smelling the air freshener and the air conditioning in your car. It was really, really crazy. To help break up the arduous journey, each rider had to complete a challenge along the way. Everything from eating at every McDonald's they passed or the more daring bikini scooter washing. If a challenge wasn't met, the penalty was severe. I'm trusting you, dude. The challenges ended up being, I think, our favorite part of the trip because it really gave something else to, to think about. When they reached the finish line in Mukilteo 11 long days later, their feeling of accomplishment was overwhelming. It was slow, but you really get to experience like the tangible beauty of America when you're that exposed and vulnerable and, uh, and just out there. There are faster ways to get across the country, but for these riders, the slow way is paved with the most memories. What we were able to go through together and accomplish together was staggering, and I'm really proud of it. Oh, those helmets though, thank you, Jimmy. And if you would like to see Justin and his crazy friends go on that wild cross country trip, it's in a documentary called Slow Ride Home, which is now out on Amazon Prime Video.